Hi, I'm Steve from Fiberglass. Today we're looking at sheets of our polyisocyanurate foam in the two pound density, available at fiberglass.com. Sheets of this two pound density foam are available in four thicknesses. Our three quarter inch thick foam is part number 440. One inch thick foam is part number 441. And our one and a half inch thick foam is part number 442. And two inch thick foam is part number 443. This polyisocyanurate foam is part of our sandwich core category. For composites, sandwich core is sealed between layers of laminate skins to build thickness and strength for a part without adding significant weight. When used as a sandwich core, polyiso foam is often selected for applications where insulation is a factor. This includes refrigerated food service equipment, shipping containers, and wall and roof panels. The properties of this foam closely match those of our two pound mix and pour foam, parts number 24 and 25. Whether used as a sandwich core or for plug building, it offers a number of similar advantages. First, polyiso foam is easy to work with. It can be cut, carved, sanded, and sculpted to nearly any shape using basic hand tools. Sheets can be glued together when greater thickness is necessary. Secondly, polyiso foam is tough and versatile. It is a closed cell foam and resists oil, gasoline, and water absorption. Lastly, it can be used with any of the resins on our website, including epoxy, polyester, and vinyl ester. You can purchase sheets of polyisocyanurate foam in the two pound density, ranging in thicknesses from three quarter inch to two inch. They are sold in groups of three sheets, with each sheet measuring four foot by two foot. When your application calls for greater strength or structural support, take a look at our sheets of polyiso foam in the six pound density, our part number 448. Get more information on sheets of this foam and all of our foam and sandwich core products when you visit product pages at fiberglass.com. Thanks for watching today and don't forget to like this video.